small island developing states. They are on the front lines of climate change, pursuing sustainable development. They share unique issues, small size, remoteness, limited resources, and global environmental challenges. Even though they emit the least carbon into our atmosphere, these countries suffer the worst effects of climate change. The Small Island Developing States Accelerated Modalities of Action, or the Samoa Pathway, was adopted in 2014 to support these countries' sustainable development efforts. Five years on, the international community will gather in New York on 27 September to review and speed up progress on the Samoa Pathway. It will be a pivotal moment to address the climate crisis, protect the ocean, strengthen public health systems, scale up new opportunities for economic growth, and forge genuine and durable partnerships. Small island nations are already taking action to implement the Samoa Pathway and the Sustainable Development Goals. But they cannot do it alone. We need more partnerships between these and other countries across the globe. We need more involvement from businesses, academia, civil society, and young people. This will be key to paving the way for more resilient and more prosperous island nations. At the high-level midterm review of the Samoa Pathway, countries will decide where to go from here for better lives and a healthier environment for all. <laughs>